Welcome to the RSA Algorithm video tutorial. The following exercises will show you how to encrypt and decrypt a message using public and private keys. Exercise 1. Encrypt the given message with the following parameters. Your friend's public key is given by the following numbers. And the message is, cryptography is fun. In encrypting the message, we are going to use the following cipher code where A is represented by 0, 1, B is represented by 0, 2, and so on, with the space being represented by the number 27. Step 1. First, let us enter your friend's public key. So we want to select the value of N from our question, hold down the control key, and drag it into our table. And then we want to select the value of E from our question and do the same thing. Now scrolling down, Enter the message you want to encrypt. So we have our message, cryptography is fun. So we can just select it, hold down the control key, and drag it over here. By clicking this button, we are taking our message and generating it in cipher code. We need to do this to convert our message into a numerical value. So click this button over here. And notice that we have 03, which is represented by C, 18, which is represented by R, and so on. And now let us encrypt the message. By clicking this button, we are taking the two elements of our friend's public key and the message generated as cipher code to create an encrypted message which you will send to your friend. So let's click this button over here. Now you can send this message to your friend and they will be able to use their private key to decrypt the message. Note that your friend must also have access to the cipher code to get the meaning of the message. This concludes exercise one. Exercise two, decrypt the message with the following parameters. Your private key is given by these two large numbers and your friend sends you the following encrypted message. In decrypting the message, we are going to use a cipher code where A is represented by 0, 1, B is represented by 0, 2, and so on, with the space being represented by the number 27. Note that we can only use the cipher code to decipher the message if your friend sent the message using the same cipher code. Enter your private key. So first we want to select the value of n from the question, hold down the control key, and drag it into our table. And then we want to do the same thing for the value of d. And then we want to enter the message we want to decrypt. So we can select that over here and drag it into our table. Now let's decrypt the message. By clicking this button, we will get the message our friend sent us. So let's click this button over here. Notice, however, that it is still in a numerical value. To get the meaning of the message, we must decipher the message. And to do that, we will use our cipher code. Note that this process will only work if your friend sent you the message using the cipher code. So let's click this button down here to get the meaning of the message. And here we have the message, keep your private key a secret. So what we have done is taken your private key and an encrypted message, and then we decrypted the message and generated it in cipher code, and then we deciphered the message using our cipher code to get its meaning. Note for this process to have worked, your friend must have encrypted the message using your public key, and use the same cipher code that you used to decipher the message. This concludes exercise two. Thank you for watching the RSA algorithm video tutorial.